Hi, this is MC Shetty for a new episode of my Let's Play. And I want to automate the spawner. So, um, and I want to do it with RF2's control. So that means that I need a lot of cactus green. And I also used up two of my nether stars to make an acceleration wand. Now that nether star should be easy to get. I added um, this uh, private version of the pack uh, has an extra, a new fee version of rf control that has new opcodes to read the, sp the spawner so that I can feed the right materials. And that's what I will uh, experiment with. So, to make cactus green, is that the best way? There's nothing to make more than one. Okay, I just have to, to melt it. Let's see. So I need a, a programmer. I need a brown card. Oh, and the brown card needs card base. I need a processor. This one, oh, two car pieces, and I'm already out. Okay, so I will go and grow a bit of more cactus green before continuing, because I'm checking if there are other. It's from bees, I haven't done bees yet, although I want to at some point. This is it's also bee related. All kind of herbs. No, I think it will be best to just use the cactus for now. I'm comparing the water can versus acceleration wand. So the water can certainly not faster but it has the advantage that it can do two cacti at the same time next to each other so if I put them in a better pattern it might work better but it also has to be recharged and this one is recharged automatically because I put wireless charge there so I think I will keep using the acceleration one for now at some point I may want to automate this as well. I think it's faster as well. Oh. Okay. By the way, this version of RF2's control also has a new data type. It's the long int instead of normal int, which is only 32 bits, but long int is 64 bits. And that allows you to do the new long opcodes, um, which should be able to get, but I haven't tested it yet, um, a 64 bit version of energy for very big uh, energy storage. But this is the new opcode that I want to try. Let's just do this every 10, 20 ticks. We read out machine information. Uh, I need to specify a note. I mean I need to make a note. Let's see another 
this. So I made the network card. Set up missing channel. Uh, test. Oh, no, no. Okay, of course. Spanish. It has been a while since I used my own mod. I hardly know how it works. So net setup main one node okay and the node is called spanner so that means that spanner and the side is facing south And index, there are three slot, three indices, and they should give um, the, the the amount of material in one of the slots. So, but we are just going to print it out for now. Oh, message last string. Probably outside. It's a little bit annoying, but oh, I need to make this platform bigger. So let's see. Yeah, zero dot nine, and that should correspond. That's a note, wrong one. Zero dot nine, that's key matter. It's uh, rounded, but uh, okay, so it works. Um, using the three values, I can know which one I'm short and which I have to insert. So I'll make a program for that. I'm also going to experiment if putting a single brick above the shield stops the wither from uh, going through. So, let's see. Is it. Yeah, it's coming in. Um, okay, seats are really not much. Seats are not very good here. Let me see if I can find something else. So, this should be a lot better. Let me check. Yeah. And this one will also work. But.
just to test okay time to get out So it can't get through now. And here's another star. Let me turn off the shields. So that's that single block is a good solution. Nothing was destroyed here. No. Okay, that's ideal. <coughs> but there's still a lot to do. First I need to automate the inputs. I'm also probably going to use three of these instead of just one for each type of input. I need to automate some kind of living material to input here. And I need something to collect um, to collect this nether star. Let's yeah. Insects are useful, so okay. So my first priority for the with the Spanish is uh, living material to actually uh, feed the Widerspanners. Um, and I think I'm going to do that in one of the remaining rooms, maybe this one. So that will require some building first. And I think I'm going to use potatoes. Oh, by the way, I also make a sack of storage to help with my inventory space. Um, but the first thing I'm going to do is to spawn a few withers manually because I'd like to have um, the wireless thingy for uh, um, refined storage wireless grid. So that's okay, I can do that. But I think to have a wireless grid. How does it work again? The uh, wireless transmitter. This one. Infinite wireless transmitter. Okay. That needs another start. Instead, that was a. But maybe. How far does this go? Let me check that out. Part sandwich. So it needs to be placed on the cable. Um, means I need a cable. Let me see. Not from pattern logistics. <laughs> so, ah, why did I do that? I actually have cables already. It's a bit stupid. So, it needs to be placed on a cable. Or This cable needs to be placed on cable. Um, I'm probably missing something. Is it? 
let me look this up. Okay, I got it to work like this, which is a bit weird, but... Okay, range is not much, but I think there are upgrades. Mm. Range upgrade. Upgrade. Okay, let me b make this. So it seems the maximum you can do is 48 blocks. It's not a lot, so I'm probably going to want to upgrade to the infinite version. But first, I need to warn us a wireless terminal, I think. It's probably this one. For which I Okay, I'm going to have to do a bit of crafting construction core. Yes. I still need improved processors. Bented improved processor. I have a few of these and what was it again? Printed silicon. I don't have printed silicon. Silicon. Okay. It works. Very, very nice. Um, but I wonder, is there no crafting? So, yeah, wireless crafting grid. How do I have to make all of this again? Come. It would be nice if I could just upgrade this. So I have to make a few things again. Um, being able to upgrade would have been nice. Destruction call and construction call. Crafting grid. Okay, this is better. It's a bit unfortunate that I wasted the materials for that other thing. But at least I have this. But let me check what the range is. Yeah, it still works here. No, it's too far already. So. Infinite transmitter, which 
means I need the nether star. Actually, I have one. But um, I must always, if the have to Spanish, one must be careful not to use up the last nether star, because otherwise... Um, well, you have to be able to feed new, a new nether star for the next 10 withers. Otherwise, uh, you have to kill it the normal way again. So let me just first... Um, yeah, no access here either. So first enable that one, then enable that one. And put in the potatoes. Um, I might need to get some more. It's not likely to be enough. I think I had range about here. Yes. Uh, the leaf blocks. Check this out. So how far am I? Oh, almost. It's not that much anymore. Where is it? Um, ah, okay. Something to collect. <coughs> Sorry. Something to collect. Another star will be useful thing. Okay. Now that I have two, I should be able to make the infinite wireless transmitter. Needs two of these. So that means I need another machine casing, that means I need a lot of this again. And this one. Oh, it broke. Oh, that's the upgrades, of course. Um, I have enough. Did it actually? Yeah, it used another star. Okay. This one has no upgrade, so let me see how far I can go now. Okay, very nice. This is going to be a lot nicer. So, I opened up a new area, new area here. For, um, this will be for uh, farms, for uh, living material for the spawner, but also for food stuff and so on. Uh, not sure yet what, what mods I will use to actually make the farms, maybe actually additions, or maybe I go check what other options I have. There's also forestry which I haven't used before, but I think the forestry form is a bit big to put in there. So this one is an option. I want to use forestry at some point. It's helping in my pack, the pack cycles I use for so long. Basic form. I'm not sure what these mine colonies. Yeah, so 
few options. Not sure yet, probably actually editions. But that will be for next episode, as uh, it's time to wrap up now. So, see you next time. Bye bye.